Hey guys, RPM here. Hope you all doing well and having a really great day. In this video, I want to stack a bunch of my 12 GPU mining frames, which most of them are all 6 GPU mining rigs. As uh, hopefully you guys know, the reason why I do that is because if I did 12 GPUs, then they would get really hot because uh, they're pretty close together in terms of the spacing if I did 12. So I've kept them all 6 GPU mining rigs, which has been great. But I have just been sent these stacking tubes from Mr. Jay Travaglini. He's another crypto mining YouTuber. He has graciously sent these to me. Thank you so much, man. This, this is so sick. I love this. I, I want to stack them in this video. I'm going to dedicate this video to you, man. So thank you so much. Everyone, please go subscribe to Mr. Jay Travaglini. I'll have a link down below in the description. Would really appreciate it. I love his content and you guys should definitely go check them out. But look at this. This is how these are stacked. Isn't that sweet? That is so nice. That I can't wait to put it on top. And they're red as well. And before we begin, this video is sponsored by Octominer. They just sent me their swag packs here uh, with a shirt and sticker and coasters. Love it. Oh, also magnets. Check this out. Love that. I love that. But if you guys are interested or looking for server cases for mining, check out Octominer.com. They have their X8 Ultra Plus. Uh, actually, I have one over here. X8 Ultra Plus with the bigger 140 mil fans and more power supply capacity. About 3000 watt capacity versus the X8 Ultra, which they don't sell anymore. Uh, as you guys know, I bought a bunch of the X8 Ultras, but they only have 120 mil fans and two 1200 watt power supplies. You guys have seen me make a lot of videos on these, so go check it out if you guys are interested. Links down in the description below. All right guys, so let's begin. And oh, I forgot to mention, I also got another package from Andovolution Australia from www.aamining.com.au. They just sent me some of their RGB fans and also some of their risers as well. I just received this pack. I was like, oh, that's sick. Oh, look at their splitters too. So if anyone is in Australia, I checked out their website, they got a lot of stuff in stock. So if you're in Australia and you are interested in mining, I know I have a bunch of Australian viewers and I think I had someone ask me uh, about a week ago <laughs> at where to buy you know, mining parts in Australia and here's a great example. Uh, thank you for the risers, man. Thank you so much. Ando Volution Australia, that is awesome, man. Thank you for the lovely package. All right, guys, let's keep going here. So I want to stack the mining rigs. Let's do it. Let's go ahead. I want to do, uh, let's just do one first and we'll see how it looks. I am going to rearrange some stuff here as I do have, uh, I want to move my 3060 Ti rig. Oh, actually, I wanted to show you guys how much Ethereum. Some of you may have seen the video where I built this rig and it theoretically cost about $11,000 USD at the peak in May. On eBay, these 3060 Ti's were selling for about, you know, over 1,400, sometimes 2,000 for the Asus Strix 3060 Ti. So these are non-LHR, all right, this is back in May of 2021. And since then, we've mined about two Ethereum, or as of recording, $6,158 worth. So has this rig broken even yet? since May of 2021 and no, it has not, it has not. There were times though when Ethereum price was much higher uh, than it is today, which I think is about 3,100 as of recording. And so maybe I should have sold the Ethereum, but like I said, I'm gonna hodl the Ethereum that I am mining on this rig up until I essentially break even or even if the merge comes, then maybe we have to switch to another coin to you know hit that theoretical uh, ROI on this rig. Just a little update for some of you that were maybe wondering about this 3060 Ti rig. It's mining by itself to a single address on, on my trust wallet here. So uh, I will keep you guys updated when we, uh, I guess in another six months, maybe more, if we potentially break even on this 3060 Ti rig. Oh man, it's very, very dusty. Anyways, let me move some stuff around and we will stack one frame first. And then I do want to stack some other ones. I'm not sure how how high I want to go. I guess we could do maybe three high. 
I don't know. Uh, maybe I just, I might just do too high. I, I don't think I could lift the mining rig on top. But let me do that right now. You guys will see something changed over here in three, two, one. Okay, so things got out of hand and my OCD was kicking in. So everything is literally off right now. All of my mining rigs are off, but you guys can see right here, two level stacked high 12 GPU mining frames. Look at that. I think this looks really good, really good. Look at the clearance between the bottom of the frame of the other rig and the top there, there is definitely clearance for the GPUs, which is awesome. Look at that, guys. What do you think? I was gonna do three, but I just realized uh, it was really hard to get up there. I I'd need like a step ladder to put another rig on top. So yeah, I wasn't gonna do three. Even if I did three high, I would probably run into the issue of power because I only have one 240 volt 30 amp PDU on this side and I'm not quite sure if I can power all of these rigs here So I have three 3070 non LHR rigs. I have a 3070 TI rig uh, Which is my Raven coin rig you guys know and then I have a Asus uh, th This one's all Asus Strix cards 3090 3080 3070 3060 3060 TI and Yeah, I don't know if I can power all this in one. I'm gonna figure that out right now actually, but you guys can see this side. Look, it's all empty. I have uh, pretty much, I don't need to put anything in the middle now. The only thing I really need these shelves for is to keep the cables off the ground. So uh, you guys can see that I moved all of my OctaMiner cases on one side here. So this is going to be great. This is gonna look so good. I'm, I was getting OCD about it because I, I was initially gonna stack some frames here, but then I had OctaMiner cases here and then I have the Mystic Miner cases, you guys know over here and it was getting kind of I didn't really like it and I do have a mine box one there with 3070 TIs and so I, I just need to I, I'm gonna do this part in another video as I got power cables and I need to redo all the networking and stuff and yeah I, I move the PDU over this way because I'm since I'm gonna be a vertical you guys can see I, I put the OctaMiner X8 Ultras and X8 Ultra Plus vertical that I will need to have basically more dense power uh, just my PDUs are going to be closer together uh, since these OctaMiners really density, right? All the GPUs are in a smaller form factor in a server case, a lot more efficient in terms of the airflow and cooling. One quick thing, this is not about the OctaMiners in this video, but you can see that this X8 Ultra Plus is a little bit taller than the X8 Ultra. Right, so they don't sell the X8 Ultra anymore. It's all the X8 Ultra Plus. So that's something I did not know that it was a little bit bigger, uh, I guess wider. Let me go ahead and I just, I love this. Jay Traviglini, thank you again for these stacking tubes, man. I love this. I don't know if you're selling these or if you're gonna be, or if they're on Thingsverse, but yeah, it looks like there is a little bit of a, of a barrier in the middle so that it stops it from, I guess, going down all the way. So that's, that's pretty cool, you guys can see there. So let me go ahead, I'm gonna now plug in everything. I have all the cables out, I need to make things look nice. So you guys will see it all running hopefully in three, two, one, if I have enough power. Okay, there we go. Somewhat nicely cable managed for my networking. All the power cables are plugged into all the power supplies. Now, I had enough power to power on all six of these rigs. So, looking at my trip light, 240 volt, 30 amp PDU, I am on 11 amps on this side, and then I am using 13 amps on this side. So I'm a little bit over the 80% rule on this 15 amp bank. But uh, you know what, I think that's fine. Uh, these can go up, uh, like this is an enterprise grade PDU from Triplight, so that is really good. And yeah, so yeah, wow, I was surprised I can power all six of these rigs. They're all mining, 3070 rigs, 3070 TI, uh, mixed Asus Strix rig, and this is a mixed LHR 3070 TI, 3060 V2 and a 3060 V1. And they're all, oh, that's, is this a dead fan? That, oh, nope, that's not a dead fan, just an extra PCIe stuck in the, 
So I did, <laughs> that's funny, I did have a 3080 Ti at the top here, so that is not plugged in, otherwise that probably would have taken uh, another amp or so, but we are good, guys, we are good. Let me know what you think about this. I, I am not touching this. This is gonna stay just like this. I need a cable manage back here, uh, it's okay. I think this is great, look at this, I love it. Dre Travaglini, thank you so much for the stacking tubes, my friend. This is awesome, this is such a great idea. I love that I can stack these now. Man, one thing I had, an idea, is I, I do have more of these 12 GPU mining frames, as you guys know, and uh, I guess I am eventually gonna be moving to Octominer cases, and you know what? I, I think I'm gonna keep this row for like open air rigs, cause then I can still do content on open air rig st type of stuff. And then on this side, which I'm gonna do another video, I'm, I'm, ex I'm just extremely exhausted uh, from setting up that other side, so, this side, I don't have anything plugged in, but I do have two PDUs, but that will be for another video, my friends. Okay, that's it, guys. Oh, man, I totally forgot to plug in my 3060 Ti rig. OCD's kicking in. I don't want to do it on this side. You know what? I'm going to figure that out later. Okay, my friends, thanks so much. Let me know what you think of these stacking tubes for the 12 GPU mining frames. Jay Travaglini, thanks again, man. You guys, go subscribe to Jay Travaglini. Thank you so much. I'll see you all in the next video in this monstrosity I have to do in another video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. And peace out. I love this. I love this. So sick.